I'm using a soda can mainly because I just want to show you quickly how to cut straight and I'm going to use a pair of scissors on this because this is basically the way now I've got my line here that you can see and I'm just basically going to cut around this one just to get the top relieved and I'm cutting way away from the line that I want to cut to begin with Trying not to waste much time here. And all this is trying to get all got all wrinkled up, but we're not worried about that. That's the reason why I cut so far away from the line. Now as I get close to this line down here, I'm see I'm going I'm gonna cut pretty close to it. I'm gonna let the can, like I let go here, you see the can is gonna do the rolling. I'm not gonna push into it very far to do my cutting. That way I'm not kinking the sides. This is how to get a straight cut. I'm going to try to cut evenly, but for some reason it always seems that you go down into it and cut deeper each time, or it gets a little uneven. You can always check by turning it upside down and seeing which way it turns. Plus, I've already got the line there. If I cut this way, you know, it's just really what it wants to do is cut into there. And it wants to take a left-hand turn. This is because this side of the scissors the top part of the scissors is on this side and this part is on the left so cutting on the other side allows me to cut a straight line now I'm getting close I'm going to take my scissors like this sometimes swapping it over in hand now I'm cutting with the can on the other side and this still allows this piece to peel out and I can just basically let the can float much easier showing you on this aluminum can here and I don't know if you can see the line like I can I use the light to see the line by the reflection and if you keep this inside edge of the top one right on the line it'll stay there now if you open your scissors up and cut in again it's going to leave a little burr or sliver of steel or uh, whatever uh, material you're using now if I keep it like this and now I push in as I go like this that'll keep that from happening and basically the scratched line on the aluminum cans helps it to stay right in the groove and cut you notice this that is perfect and it's basically the same principle on these but we're using these this will have to be cut this way. If I cut this way, I'm trying to peel out this and it's going to mess it up. And getting down into this groove, it's the same idea. Keep the edge right there. The other thing that I messed up on when I rushed into this project was this shorter half should have been the top half. Since the heat is going to, was going to be applied to the bottom, now as the heat travels up the side, this is going to be a lot hotter than it would have been. I should have had it this way, with the rod coming out this way. 